Hello, my boy. It is Tuesday, bad me, the 19th of February. And I have just got back from uni, spent a day in the labs. Um, and yeah, my, my week hasn't been very eventful, to be honest. Um, I was sitting here just a minute ago trying to think of, of, of what to talk about for, for this video. And just not much has gone on in the last week that's sort of out of the ordinary. Um, just normal stuff, doing some, writing some notes up and went and saw Helen at the weekend. That was a nice as always. And um, So maybe I'll just talk about little small things that went on. Um, I made, with Helen, a steak and ale pie. And I know that I think we tried to make one before. I don't know if we tried to make one before, but we have got an absolutely banging recipe now. Like, we've got such a good recipe for a, a really, really good steak and ale pie. Um, it was my meat meal of the week, um, which feels a little bit like cheating because it's so massive and takes quite a lot of red meat, quite a lot of beef, which is quite bad. But, um, but it's so good. It's one of those things, like, it's worth it's worth having like a week one day a week just to like experience the joy of eating that like we made our own pastry which is way better than um like surprisingly way way better than, than the stuff you get in the, in the shop um you like get it doesn't matter how tough a bit of, of beef you get because basically you just cook it on the hob because we don't we didn't have a casserole dish we just cook it on the hob with everything else so what you do is you, you like brown the meat so you like like blast it on each side so it maintains it's kind of it, it gets brown on the outside so it's still juicy in the middle and then you like fry onion garlic bacon like a little bit of, of, of bacon um carrots celery um mushrooms of all kinds uh, and then you put it all in a pot with the meat and then you like pour like a bottle of ale on and like some stock and some tomato paste and some thyme and all this stuff and then you just like let it cook on slow for like as long as you can really like we did it for about three hours and it just turns into this like amazing pie filling it's so good it's quite salty um but not too salty like it's just on that like sort of just underneath that so it was really nice oh, such a good pie so did that also made some sticky buns so we did some enriched, uh, enriched dough with egg and sugar. Left that to, um, left that to rise once. Uh, made some caramel and pecan kind of sauce. Uh, rolled the dough, like got that, got the dough back, having let it um, prove a little bit rolled it up into like like spread cinnamon like rolled it out spread cinnamon sugar on it roll it up so it's in little rolls cut it into cut the rolls into like sections so you got lots of little lots of rolls and then put those in a tray with the pecan and caramel sauce um and then let that rise again uh, until it all it fills out the whole space on the uh on the in the tray and then bake uh bake it uh, for 30 minutes until it's gone brown and eat those tasty buns man they're really good the dough was so good actually the texture was amazing and i've still got some they get a bit dry they get dry quite quickly but like on when they're just done oh my god they're amazing um so that was kind of a weekend mainly food related um and yeah highlight my week um as the weekends no normally are um uh everything else is just kind of normal um writing up like i said writing up notes um doing project stuff which is kind of chugging along but we're hitting some snags but you know it'll be what it'll be um oh i got my results forgot that got my results i already knew what they really were um but i've kind of got a confirmation of roughly how much i need to do this semester so like i could get slightly under 40 and everything and still get a two one so like that's not an ish the issue is no longer will I pass my degree? I will pass my degree. I've got, I've definitely got to do one. Um, net, but I could get a first. So it's like, if I get, I think it's about 65 overall, I'll get a first, 65, I think. Or if I get the 70%, so if I get 
55 units over 70 that I only need about 59 which is doable if I carry on with the same marks as I've got as I usually get it's that's doable it would just be um, if this this semester might be really difficult we shall see that is all that I really have to say uh, your last video is great I love the knife I love the idea of just like getting yourself a really tasty knife to get back into cooking it's a great idea and you know I love the knife um, can't wait to try it out um, I'm, it sounded like your skiing sounds amazing uh, you said you just had the best day ever and like I can totally imagine it I like, can totally imagine the way that it like the kind of feeling of being a superhero you just kind of like do anything and anything like do anything and I'm trying to think of where I've sort of thought about feeling that before because I, I really identify with that feeling of just like I like I'm invincible I can go anywhere do anything like just like ride off cliffs and stuff but like, I can't remember where it's from but I understand um, even if I haven't done it um, sounds amazing um, yeah that is that is all I should say I'm going to London this weekend I said that's all I should say I'm going to London this weekend with Helen going to go and see the Book of Mormon so I'll tell you about that um, but yeah I hope that you're doing well I'm sure you are um, and I'll see you on the flip side Stay out.